New Mexico State in Hollywood tonight at Loyola Marymount. Before you see the highlight, I'm going to show you NMSU's team numbers from the conclusion. Some real final destination type stuff here. You could start a bakery with all those turnovers. Aggies gave it away 26 times. Huck and Bricks from three, and they went without a made basket the last seven plus minutes. Those are not winning statistics, especially on the road against a solid LMU team. But Chris Jans and the Aggies entered the matrix. I, I don't know how they did it. 26 turnovers in Los Angeles. Aggies looking for their third straight win. Final minute before the half, we are tied. Mario McKinney Jr. goes right into the Lions' den. Hun most definitely intended. Strong finish at the rim to give NMSU a 25-23 lead at the break. Second half, 7.38 to play. Jabari Rice. Hands to step back, Jay. But this was the last made field goal by New Mexico State in the ballgame. The Aggies scored 12 more points the rest of the way, all via free throws. And when they weren't scoring, they were stopping. Johnny McCants, the help side block there. Uh, listen, Loyola Marymount couldn't hit shots either, but the Aggies gave up nothing on the boards. Under a minute to play. We're going to go to the baseline, Cam. Check the clock. Aggies up 57-56, and everyone in a black jersey is straight up. Eli Scott misses the layup. Lions want a foul call, foul call, but that was clean as attack. Only stat that matters at the end of the game, the win. And it goes in favor of NMSU, 63-58. Aggies have won three straight by a combined 10 points. Chris Jans post game, just as surprised his team won as the rest of us. But his takeaway is one that'll make Aggies fans very happy moving forward. The one thing in a, in a positive way is they're starting to play you know, more like some of our teams are showing some characteristics of, of some of these teams that we've had in the past with just locking in and, and digging down and the competitive spirit that, um, you know, some of these teams that we've had in the past and just finding a way to win on the road. Yeah, Jans has won over 100 games in five years as NMSU's coach. His teams that he referenced, all winners. Next up for the Aggies, a trip to Washington State on Wednesday. Cougars are going to have to shake off their game tonight. They're tied up with South Dakota State. Under 10 seconds to play before Baylor Shireman of the Jackrabbits playing rec league hoops. Watch your ankles and hold this L. Down go the Cougs at the horn. Take another look, Shireman. Call that hot cross buns. Jack Rabbits are nine and three. Wazoo in New Mexico State. 8 p.m. tip on Wednesday night.